welcome back and I'm going to be doing a bathroom reset today as my bathroom was looking a bit grim and the drawers needed decluttering so I thought I'm just going to reset the whole of my bathroom. I'm just going to show you the before so the sink wasn't looking great, it was very lime scaly and there was toothpaste in there then there was a bit of mould around the silicone of the bath which really needed cleaning as I haven't done it in a while and it does build up and also around the sticker that we put on the wall to hook our like shampoos and conditioners up I took the towels off the rail and that definitely needed shining as it had all water on it also the drawers were looking a little bit cluttered so I thought I need to sort them out a little bit. I didn't properly sort them out but I made them look a lot neater and easier to get to the products. To start off with I take all the towels out and the bath mats and anything on the sides as I don't want to ruin these with bleach like I had before and I'm just taking my little caddy of products then starting with the pink stuff and a scrub daddy and I'm just starting on the shower screen After I finished scrubbing I went in with my window vacuum and just got rid of all the soap on the window and then I was like they're still dirty so I had to clean the other side so I went in with some window cleaner and just started to scrub that with the scrub daddy and then I go in with the vacuum again after just to get rid of all the soap and the window cleaner. As I wanted a really shiny screen this time, I went in with a polishing cloth and just gave the screen a quick buff on both sides just to get rid of any little marks and make it shiny.
I'm just going to use some bleach on a toothbrush and go in between the grout lines as these were looking not too bad but they were getting a bit mouldy and for some reason they go orange. I don't know if that's because we have such hard water but um, I let that settle for a little while whilst I clean the bath with bleach. To the drawers now they weren't too bad as i didn't do them that long ago but where you're using stuff and pulling stuff out stuff just gets in the wrong place and just gets a bit messy so i decided to take all the products out and give it a quick wipe wasn't too bad because obviously everything's in tubs i then put the plastic tubs back and started to fill them up most of the stuff is mine, so I've tried to categorise it a little bit. So like in the left hand corner is skincare and then you've got masks and then in the other corner you've got razors and then next to that is toothbrushes and then in the right hand corner is like hairsprays and teeth products.
found this new sponge and it's got like little bristly bits in it and it shines up chrome so good. I got it in B&M the other day. I'm not sure what they're called. I think they're like diamond scourers or there's something like that and they don't scratch either. Really recommend them. So I used that on the towel rail and then I just buffed it over with a microfiber cloth after and it's come up really well. I'm onto the floor now. So before I mop, I have to like scrape the floor because for some reason my bathroom just gets loads of dust. Don't know why, because I try and keep the door closed, but it just accumulates so much dust. So I thought I'd squeegee the floor first to get all rid of the hair, the dust, the fluff, whatever it is on there, and just scrape that into a pile. To mop the floor I'm using this flash floor cleaner and I just filled a jug up with a bit of water and I added a little cap full of the floor cleaner as I couldn't be bothered to fill up a whole bucket to mop so I just poured some on the floor and started mopping. I think all in all this bathroom clean took me around two and a half hours not sure why it took so long but i done it properly this time as this is literally the cleanest my bathroom's ever been and all the mold's gone around the bath which is very nice and i hope it stays away because it's very annoying cleaning that all the time and my shower screen is literally shining i also put a new air freshener thing in the toilet you know that goes over the bowl I don't know what they're called. It's a new scent. It's lemon and lime. Thank you for watching and give this video a like if you enjoyed it as it lets me know what videos people prefer and make sure you subscribe and I'll see you all soon. Bye.